For more stock news updates, remember to press the like button and subscribe. With that being said, let's get straight into the video. SoFi Technologies has been making significant progress recently, with several major developments capturing the attention of investors and industry experts alike. Over the past few weeks, the digital banking and lending platform has partnered with a new loan provider, delivered strong results for its third quarter earnings, and announced the addition of robo-investing capabilities for its customers. These advancements reflect the company's relentless drive to expand its services and solidify its position as a comprehensive financial solution for consumers. This consistent push to enhance its offerings is proving successful in increasing the company's value, which is directly contributing to higher customer acquisition. In the past month, the company's stock price has risen by 35%, a remarkable achievement that brings it closer to the record highs reached during its merger with a special purpose acquisition company back in 2020. With such a notable run-up in its valuation, many investors are now asking whether the company remains a good buying opportunity or if this growth spurt is already priced in. Let's take a closer look at its financial and operational performance to determine whether its stock still holds promise. During quarter three, the company reported another strong set of results that underscore its ability to scale rapidly. The company achieved a record number of customers, with its total customer base increasing by 35% year over year to reach 9.4 million. This substantial growth in its user base drove a 30% increase in adjusted net revenue compared to the same period last year, highlighting the effectiveness of its strategy to attract and retain customers. However, while customer and revenue growth have been consistently impressive, the company has historically faced challenges related to profitability. Over the past few quarters, management has taken deliberate steps to rein in costs and improve operational efficiency within its lending business. Looking ahead, the company anticipates generating more than $200 million in net income during 2024, a significant milestone that reflects its progress towards sustained profitability. One of the most striking aspects of the company's financial performance is its ability to generate positive earnings while continuing to reinvest heavily in growth initiatives. For instance, the company allocates more than $200 million each month to marketing efforts and spends an additional $139 million on developing new products. These significant expenditures underscore the company's commitment to scaling its operations and expanding its market share. Importantly, as the company continues to grow, these costs are expected to decrease as a proportion of its total revenue, which could further enhance its profitability over time. The company distinguishes itself in the competitive financial services landscape by offering a wide range of products designed to meet virtually all of its customers' financial needs. Its platform includes consumer banking, savings accounts, credit cards, investment services, and even cryptocurrency trading, providing a one-stop shop for users seeking convenience and integration across their financial activities. By bundling these services together, the company sets itself apart from traditional banks and fintech competitors, giving it a unique value proposition that resonates with its growing customer base. In the most recent quarter, the total number of products in use across the company's platform reached 13.65 million, demonstrating its success in cross-selling and deepening a customer engagement. To further expand its offerings, the company recently announced the launch of a robo-advisory service. This feature provides automated financial advice and portfolio management for a small fee. On the lending side, the company has also made strategic moves to optimize its business model. The company recently entered into an agreement with Fortress Investment Group to sell $2 billion in loans, marking a significant step toward becoming more asset light. The company's lending portfolio, which includes student loans, home loans, and personal loans, has traditionally been a cornerstone of its business. However, by shifting toward selling loans to third parties, the company aims to reduce its risk exposure and improve its financial stability. This $2 billion partnership with Fortress underscores its commitment to executing this strategy effectively. From a valuation perspective, the company currently has a market capitalization of $14.6 billion dollars. Its trailing price to earnings ratio of 135 might initially seem high, but investing is not about looking at past performance, it is about anticipating future growth. Since the start of 2021, the company's revenue has increased by an astounding 262%. With customer acquisition showing no signs of slowing down, it is likely that this strong revenue growth will continue in the coming years. Net income, which only recently turned positive for the company after years of losses, remains subdued due to the company's heavy investment in marketing and product development. However, this reinvestment is laying the foundation for future profitability. If the company can achieve net income of $1 billion, its price-to-earnings ratio would drop to approximately 14.6, which is well below the market average and could signal significant upside potential for long-term investors.
While the company is not without risks, it offers a compelling value proposition compared to other high-growth stocks that are currently trading at elevated valuations. Its robust growth trajectory, coupled with its focus on building a diversified and scalable business, positions it as an attractive opportunity for investors seeking exposure to the financial technology sector. In summary, SoFi Technologies offers a unique combination of rapid growth, a diversified product portfolio, and strategic financial management. While not without risks, its ability to scale and and deliver consistent results makes it an attractive investment in the financial technology space, particularly for those looking for long-term growth potential. For more stock news updates, remember to press the like button and subscribe. With that being said, I will see you in the next video.